are we getting dumb over time? This is something I've been wondering about. So I did some digging and I came across this news article on how apparently there was recently this big drop in IQ for babies. Specifically, the article refers to babies born during COVID. Apparently they have shown a lower IQ compared to babies born before the pandemic. I immediately had so many questions about this. If this is true, is this a continuing trend? Even though the pandemic is well and truly over, is it possible that babies are still showing a drop in IQ? My second question was, how generalizable are these findings? So in other words, how big was the sample size of babies in the study? How old were the babies? Where was the study based? My third question is, how do you even measure a baby's IQ in a way? Maybe this is a bit more obvious with toddlers, but what about babies who aren't really talking or moving around much yet? And my fourth question is, what do the researchers think caused this drop in IQ? Was it mum getting COVID while pregnant? Was it parental stress? Um, or maybe it was the face mask just making it harder to bond with babies. Check this out, guys. You happy? And for those of us who have babies, obviously including myself, what can this research tell us about how we can foster our baby's intelligence? This is the study we're interested in. Okay, so what was involved in the study? It's part of a longitudinal study that is based in Rhode Island and it relates to child health and development. Since 2011, this study has been collecting cognitive assessments from 672 healthy full-term children who were aged between three months and three years at the time of the assessment. How did the study measure IQ in babies? Technically, this study used the Mullen scales, not an IQ test. Although according to the news article, this pretty much corresponds to an IQ test in a way. The Mullen scales assesses cognitive function across motor control, visual reception, expressive language, and receptive language. Motor control refers to how your baby uses their body to perform certain actions, such as grabbing an object or throwing a ball. Visual reception refers to how your baby makes sense of visual information, so it could be tracking a moving object or recognizing shapes or colors. Expressive language refers to how your baby expresses certain thoughts or feelings, such as through facial expressions or potentially through words if they're older. And finally, receptive language. This refers to how well your baby seems to understand you. So what was the big finding from this study? Well, basically from 2011 to 2019, the researchers found that on average, the children scored approximately 100 on the Mullen scales. And that's what they were expecting. That's a pretty average result. But then for 2020, which is when COVID started, this average dropped to 86.3. And then for 2021, it dropped to 78.9. From 100 to 78.9, that is a huge drop and especially in a short amount of time. Something interesting about these findings is that this drop in cognitive ability wasn't due to COVID, basically because the researchers have made sure to exclude any participant who had tested positive to COVID. What these findings suggest is that the lockdowns in some way seriously impacted on the cognitive development of those babies born during that time. But what was it about the lockdowns exactly that caused this? Well, as discussed in the paper, babies need a positive, enriching environment for optimal brain development, whereas neglect, stress, and a lack of environmental stimulation can negatively impact on their cognitive and behavioral outcomes. Think about what happened during the lockdowns. So there was the closure of schools, parks, playgrounds, and daycare centers. There were parents who had to work from home while trying to look after their children. Relatives and uh, friends couldn't come over to help out. And generally, a lot of people were very stressed about COVID, uh, which potentially for a lot of parents made it harder to bond with their children. Are babies still showing a drop in cognitive ability even after the lockdowns? So I've tried looking for follow-up studies, but at this point in time, there doesn't seem to be any just yet. At the very least though, this study really does highlight just how important social interaction and environmental stimulation are for a baby's cognitive development. But of course, that's not to point the finger at those parents who had babies during COVID and whose babies seem to show some kind of cognitive delay. Um, obviously, COVID was really stressful and it massively sucked.
Anyway guys, I would love to hear your thoughts on all of this. If you'd like to see me do more videos on really interesting research findings, please remember to subscribe. In the meantime, I probably should spin more.